Hey, what's up everyone? This is Music Tech Help Guy. And in this video, I wanna talk about the channel strip copy, paste, and paste plugins and paste sends functions in the mixer in Logic Pro. These four functions um, have sort of changed and evolved. And a lot of these functions here in this menu have changed and evolved over the years with different versions of Logic. But these four in particular, I find are extremely helpful when you're trying to copy and paste channel strip settings and you just wanna take the exact same setting from one track and paste it over to multiple other tracks without having to hold option and drag each plugin over one at a time, as uh, I believe we probably all are guilty of from time to time, myself included. Okay, so I've got a track here. It's a song I'm working on, and I've got a vocal stack of some harmonies. Dr completely dry, they sound like this, but I do have a level mix and a pan mix going, and there's no plugins whatsoever. Running out of time. So they sound okay, but they're not very bright. They don't really pop out in the mix. So let's say I want to copy this channel strip setting, which is the same channel strip setting used on all of these vocal tracks here. You click on the setting tab, and then you go down to copy channel strip setting, or you can use the shortcut option command C. Then what you can do is you can click on one or multiple tracks in the mixer, and you can select paste channel strip setting or option command V. Now that pastes over all of those plugins, but what it also pastes over are the pan settings, the volume setting, as well as any buses or sends that are on those tracks. So this is completely undone the mix that I had earlier. So let me just command Z that a few times. So sometimes that may be the function you actually do want to use, and, and sometimes it may not. So I'm gonna go up to setting here and we're gonna copy this again. I don't actually have to copy it again. Select all of these, go up to setting and there's another option, paste plugins only. This is one of my favorite features because it only pastes the plugins but does not affect the sends, does not affect uh, the bus, the routing, the panning or the volume. Running out of time. Yeah, that is way better, and I'm able to keep the same mix with the pan and volume as I had before I pasted in the plugins. Now, one last one I wanna show you. Let me just undo a few times here to get this out of the way. Let's say you just want to copy a send setting, a bus setting. So let's say, this goes to bus six. This goes to bus 17. And then I have particular settings for each one. If I come up here, go to setting, copy channel strip setting, drag over one or more tracks, and then select paste sends only. It just pastes the sends. So you're getting the send uh, amount as well as the send assignment to its particular bus. So this is really helpful when you have you know multiple tracks that have completely different mixes, but then you want them to all have the same amount of reverb or chorus or delay or whatever time-based effects you're using on your aux tracks. So those are four insanely helpful mixing functions in the Mixer and Logic Pro. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please leave it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel to see more content like this. As always, thank you so much for the support and thanks for watching.